What's up, my guys? My name is Natsuki Haragi, aka Rainbow Animation. Because, and today, I'm talking about the document that was created by just another person who created it. This is an anonymous iguana who makes documents. This is Spinosaurus Studios, the Akusa of, of YouTube poop. His introduction. Spinosaurus is a member of YouTube poop community who has been around for many years since the creation, channel creation, December 31st, 2017. Most New Year's Day, 2018. In six and a half years since then, he made lots of YTPs and hosted many collabs. As of June 26, 2024, his channel has over 6,000 subscribers. However, he has recently gained a, a, a horrible reputation for his disrespect toward others in the YTB community, blatant and extreme egotism, begotted statements, usage of discriminatory slurs, such as the N and the F slurs, cheating in T Team Fortress 2, and, ab and abusing the site to remove much content speaking negatively about him as him. The incidents re involving his own unacceptable behaviour toward other YouTube poopers were mostly prominently within the last year, and we traced back as far as July 2022. In this document, every incident in this, his will will be covered chronologically up to the current date as such. The severity of each incident and portion of a drama was very far out. The Discord ban. The Discord screenshot reveals in the one that on July 7th, 2022, Spinosaurus Studios' original Discord account was deleted, prompting him to create a new one, which is the account he uses to this day. While talking about this ban, he speculates the reason may, may be being because of the anti-Muslim message. The School's Out Rock 2 YCB collab. In July 12, 2022, Spinosaurus Studios uploaded a video titled YouTube Pope Collab School's Out Rock 2, an official sequel to the collab hosted by former community member Emp Lemon. Within it, within it is an entry made by Camhead, who left the community in March 2022, Early, early March 2022, of the, of the information on him, grooming several miners was made public. Camphead made his entry with his collab before that. Despite everything that happened to relate to him, however, Spinosaurus Studios still decided to include his entry in the collab. He even praised his work in the collab in the comments. In fact, he, he haven't even credit, credited Ebb Lemon for hosting the original collab at all, and to the comment point pointed out he should have done so. Spinosaurus Studios dismissed it, however saying he didn't care if he stole or not, and he claimed he would keep doing it. Transphobia and al albalism on Twitter. November 28th, 2022, com community member J JT Rock posted on Discord about two tweets from Spinosaurus Studios, one posted on that day, and this other six days earlier. The first read, If you're a non-binary, read a fucking book and realize there's no fucking such thing. Fuck your pronouns too. It's male, female, um, hermaphrodites, and trans. There is no non-binary, gender, sex, fucking morons, and all of the gender fluids. Fuck no to you too. Pick one and stick with it. The second was directed towards JT Rock. Ah, uh, you autistic of course. No wonder why you're insufferable to be around and have serious social skills. It explains a lot, actually. See you want see what see which one hurts more. Cry some more. Pi Pivado mockery. Pi Pivado was a notable member of the of the YTB community, but tragically died on February seventeenth, twenty nineteen, taking his own life at just fifteen years old. Four years later, in February 12, 2023, Twitter user Les Brian Griffin shared that at one point, Spinosaurus owned a YouTube channel dedicated to, this, to the mockery of Peter Fibito's death. Currently, no one knows about his channel's name and his creation date and his deletion date, but no archive videos are known to exist. Spinosaurus Studios was known as, as the type of person who, who made this random Twitter user. Twitter, Twitter, um, okay. Moving on. Cheating in Team Fortress 2. He has been spotted using cheats in the 2007 multiplier first person shooter TF2. 
Two videos were posted by YouTube users Syropy and Senene, uploaded on February 21st, 2023, and April 30th, 2023, respectively. Both show proofs of him cheating with the game, as well as the hostile and offensive language. In May 15, 2023, just half a month after his upload, Spin he successfully got Sime's video taken down, utilizing YouTube's video reporting function. That's not cool, mate. This video has been since been archived. He didn't get his lucky surface video, which prompted him to beg him within videos, comment section and deletion. He would continue to make comments an entire year after the video's release and finally given up. As one comment says, come back a year later, see him still replying. This is all he has. I don't know this he's his piece of shit anymore. So one Twitter archive shows a reply to Spinosaurus made on June 3rd, 2023. The tweet says, Starting to wonder if you've been spared when a car crash was a mistake. Yeah, I said it. Go be a moron elsewhere, sheep. This tweet was deleted. And no one knows the tweet was replying to. The YTV Mania takeover was occurred in September or October 2023. He created an account on YTV Mania, an online forum for members of the YouTube Hoop community, and emphasized one of his collabs, but, but in coincidence, none of his associate and federal actions controversial community member, Mr. Creator Nata, got banned off from the YouTube Mania Discord server for the blame of misgendering of a transgender YouTube Hoop creator. This prompted he. This prompted. This prompted him to create a conflict with community member Red Turbo 13, claiming he wouldn't take over YTB Mania, and they forced and tend to report Red Turbo 13's comments to silence him. Red Turbo 13 then which calls him out of the YTB Mania forums, and this account is soon suspended. Spinosaurus Studios report, retorted by uploading a video in which he accuses Red Turbo 13, community member 3012, and YTB Mania moderator Morsh of supporting Camhead, cheating in video games, racism, and transphobia, all heard of critical claims. He also makes accusations of grooming, manipulation, server raiding, and destroying the YTB Mania website. Furthermore, he calls 3012 Asperg and Morsh a CISO. Which are both certain to be often uh, used derogatorily towards people in Asperger's syndrome, before there wasn't some sexual disorder, and people with schizophrenia receptively. Finally, he assaulted 3012 and called him a number one douchebag. In December 10th, 2023, he, he announced a brand new collab on his channel based in the pilot of the web series He Made Digital Circus. His original entry deadline is January 28, 2024. We didn't take the safest of release date, and he couldn't have been in the Zoom, and the collab was soon come shortly after. As of June 26, 2024, the, the collab has still not been released, and the media's fans are expressed outrage in the amount of time it's been taking too long for, for it to come out. Get this douchebag out of here. Stay tuned for part two.